Hi, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Tamil Green, the Digital Midwife. And in today's episode, I'm going to talk to you about creating links inside of Canva. So let's get started. Whenever you're creating a document or any file, there's also a place on this top bar, if you look on my screen, that, sh that shows you, um, well, you actually have to click inside of a text box first. Once you click inside of a text box, it gives you a new menu. One of the features of the menu is the link button. And what you want to do with the link button, of course, is link things, right? There's so many different reasons why you want to link different things inside of a PDF file or anything, right? Um, maybe you create a media kit inside of Canva or anything like a PDF file or any other opt-in and you need to link things for the people that you're giving the items to. This is the perfect way to do that, right? And it's free. So two things I want to point out here is, one is you see that I have icons and I also have text boxes. So first of all, you have to have a text box for each link, okay? You can't have one big text box and link everything in one text box because it only takes on one link, okay? So if, you, if I was to have all these things together, it would only take on one of those. So I separated them out and made them their own text boxes. So that way, whenever when someone clicks on it, it takes them to that particular thing, all right? And then I also put a, a link on the icons. And I do this because you have two types of people. One type of person is going to click on the icons and one person is going to click on the text, right? Just so I don't have to choose, or just so I can get both of those people, I just do both of those, all right? So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna go right here to your icon, click on it, make it active, then go over here to your link button, and then you wanna make sure you've already grabbed your link, and all you're gonna do, I'm just gonna pretend that I, had, I didn't have it in here, and you, it would normally be blank first, and then you paste the link into there, and you click apply. And then when you click back on it, you can make sure that it's there, okay? And I've done these already, so I'm just going to check on them. And that's pretty much it. It's real simple to create a link inside of Canva. I didn't do that one. All right, let me grab this. Just copy it, apply it. And now I'm going to apply it over here. And that is it. And you just do that for whatever it is you're trying to do. Maybe you're creating um, a hot list for, for moms to buy the, the newest items for whatever it is, right? And you want to connect them straight to maybe your Amazon list or something like that. This would be a, a great way for you to do that, okay? And make it really, really cute and fancy how you want to do it. And that's all there is to it, okay? So thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate you tuning in. If you have any comments or questions, please place them down below. And please don't forget to subscribe.